So as we're all aware, Bob Ross is one of the most iconic painters and artists to ever exist. His artwork has inspired millions of people, including myself, so I decided to recreate his paintings as trendy fashion outfits, and this is how it went. Hey everyone, and welcome back to today's video. So I thought I would do something a little bit different and a little bit more like trendy, but um, sort of like keep it different and cool. Let me start again. Today's video, I thought, I have an idea when I was literally in bed at two in the morning when I had cramps and I was crying on my bed because my leg was going like this and I literally wanted to yeet myself. Anyway, I don't know if it's done before, but if it does become trendy and like goes like viral and one arm, whatever, whatever, I would like to, you know, say I also joined in on that. I thought I would, you know, take some of the one and only icon himself, Bob Ross, and use his paintings and get inspiration from his paintings and recreate them as outfits that are very trendy, Pinterest, and very current in today's sort of like wild and realm. If you do like the video, make sure you do give it a thumbs up, comment over here, comment down below, and subscribe because I post videos every single Sunday and I try and make creative ones like this. So if you do want to see anything from me or have a really cool video suggestion, this is a what's that thing called? A um this is a democracy. I give what you want, so we love to see it. Anyway, enjoy the video. Okay, so for the first outfit, I wanted to do something a little bit with more blue because I recently brought some new shoes. They are the Jordan 4 University Blues. I hear the ones right here that I brought. And I wanted to do something, you know, a little bit blue. So I went over to Google and searched, you know, Bestie Bob Brass. And one of the paintings that he did was sort of, it was all of his paintings by far are very, very beautiful. However, I'll pop the one that I've seen on the screen and I wanted to incorporate incorporate the sky with the outfit, hence why there's the blue shoes. And obviously, I don't really own a lot of green, but I decided to get into green, hence the green overshirt that you'll see. Um, so for that, obviously, I wanted to wear an overshirt and sort of keep it very neutral. So the three main colours that I took from this was the forest green, the blue, and the white slash cream sort of aspect. And this is the outfit that I created for this one. So for the second painting that I seen of his, it was reminded me very much of Christmas. It will always be Christmas in my heart. You know, because I'm obviously a Christmas hoe, I was like, oh my god, I have to do this, even though it literally is, you know, coming to the end of April and Christmas is in front of us seven months. I digress. So <laughs> I decided to again use this painting that you see here on the screen, and I really wanted to use two or three colours in this. So I decided to pair this with a blue t-shirt that I'd got from Zara, a you know, gorgeous little oversized gilet, um, some like a Bella Hadid oversized trousers. I seen her wearing them at like the petrol station and I was like, oh my god, that's so cool. I'll enter the photo here. She's literally the icon that I aspire to be. And then this is how this photo is her now. Okay, so for the last outfit of I'm loving the cars, beeping. Oh, I hate that I live near a busy road. So for the last photo, I decided to do something a little bit more me, very varsity, very sort of trendy. And I'd also brought another pair of new shoes and they are the Jordan 1 Fearless. These ones right here. And what was really nice about those is that I feel like I can get more use out of them and they also bring a nice pop of color to any outfit that I will wear. So the photo, I'll pop it up on the screen here obviously it's got a little bit of reds in there again it's got a bit of green however obviously I've already done the green so I kind of wanted to stay away from that but more incorporate the shoe colors as well as take inspiration from the canvas and this is the outfit that I ended up with from this one That is it, I know, very short, but I just wanted to, you know, give you what you asked for. I need to shut up, but also this is something that I, you know, kind of want to speak to you guys about. Basically, ages ago, around November, I went apartment hunting before I decided I want to move to London. Obviously, I'm looking at moving out anyway, and a lot of the places weren't London. So do you still want to see an apartment hunting video from me? Because I've got all the footage, I've just not, I've just not edited it or anything. So if you do want to see that, do let 
let me know in the comments down below. I'd be more than happy to do that. I'll also do a poll on Instagram. So if you don't know on Instagram, you totally should do. With that being said, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. If you do love the video, do give it a thumbs up. Comment down if you want to comment down below. Subscribe if you haven't already. And make sure you turn the post notification bell so you get a notified if I upload a random video every single Sunday. Every Friday, I'll upload a random video in a week. It will be on a Wednesday. Is it Wednesday? Is it Thursday? No, it's Wednesday. Oh my god, I forgot my own outro. Anyway, if I do, it's Wednesday or Thursday if I post an extra video, but I post every Sunday regardless, and I'm going, okay, bye! <laughs>